Hi, Leo. It's Power and Light Tarot coming up with your reading. Leo, this is going to be what are their true intentions in love, and this is a reading between you and whoever you are, whoever you are dealing with. You could be with or without them, right? Yeah, like uh, whoever sings that song, with or without you, right? Uh, that was not the right melody. <laughs> so I hope you guys are all well. And Leo, there is a situation here that brings you joy. A situation, uh, there's somebody here who you have love for. Yeah, because we have Sappho here, the card of love. And uh, somebody's ready for a new, like to take flight, a new beginning. Like they want to just fly away with this person who brings joy. They want to create something new for themselves. And uh, the hat card is here. This talks about... You're going to be in a different role. So maybe this is at work, but maybe this is in this union or this situation here. But somebody's trying to come between you here. Uh, and also, uh, Leo, I feel like what's going on here is that you're trying to figure out how this kind of all happened, maybe. Or maybe your person is, right? Because this is their reading, too. Kind of what has caused this. Uh, there's a celebration here that wants, that is like trying to take place. The dancer, yeah. Uh, this is about a celebration. And, uh, you know, also, I feel like the marker is here. Somebody is, like, really kind of figure, trying to figure out who they are. Like, kind of like, how did I get here? Did I, like, not know who I was before? Like, maybe why am I in this situation with somebody? Because maybe I have grown so much and I'm not the same person. Who am I now? Possibly, right? Just couldn't talk about that here. So let's see... Uh, Let's just have a look here at Leo at the dancer. I just want to see what else he can elaborate on. And it says, it's time to celebrate that which you have. Yeah, that which you have. Life itself is a cause for celebration. But you also have much to rejoice in your own. Mm -hmm. So this is a celebration. Maybe it's at work with this creation card. Uh, but there is love here, definitely here. Maybe you want to celebrate... I feel like you're trying to celebrate something with, with somebody here, and maybe you have something really good going on at work as well. Because the bees is here, and this is this can be busy work, but this can be togetherness. It's typically togetherness, especially next to love. Yeah, I feel like there's somebody you really kind of want to be like close to here and celebrate them. Use your energy skillfully. A cause for joy. Plenty of activity and movement. Short journeys to and fro. Celebration of party, physical discipline, and training with the dancer. Sports dance, giving something a light but skillful touch. Let's get into the reading here. I feel like you want to celebrate something with somebody, Leo. Let's look at your recent past energy here. Eight of Pentacles, Tower. In your challenges, the Three of Pentacles, you want the Ten of Swords, or you're hoping for the Ten of Swords. I mean, you want an ending. You want to end something with somebody. Mm -hmm. I feel like you do. High Priestess is what you fear or you doubt. So maybe you're fearing your intuition over here, but somebody's trying to come between you. I feel like you want an ending, and that's the person who is trying to come, like, trying to stop you here from something that you want. Something that brings you joy and that you want to celebrate, and somebody you really, really love here with these, with Sappho, right? She's wearing, she has her wings here, and, you know, she's showing her total breasts here. She is. How dare she, you know, back in, you know, 1552. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, you're seeking answers here as well. So let's see. I feel like you're headed. You want this ending, and here is the hat. You will be playing a different role. Your person's energy, Leo, is the strength card, the ten of cups. They have the king of pentacles. So maybe your person is this Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Uh, I feel like this is you showing up in their past energy. Maybe it is their courage, possibly. It could be a Pisces or a Scorpio here with the Tower and the High Priestess. And what they fear is the Queen of Pentacles. So in their challenge is the Queen of Pentacles. Uh, they could be fearing that you're in love with an earth sign here. This could be the person that brings you joy, Leo. Could be. So what they want is the Eight of Cups and what you want is an ending. I feel like they want you to leave something else and you want to end it with them. That's kind of how it looks here. Maybe they want to leave you because you want an ending, right? Could be. I mean, these are general reads, so they can go back and forth and side to side. They really can. So your challenge is the Three of Pentacles here. I feel like, and it this, I feel like this is the person you most likely want is this Earth sign. You could be leaving an Earth sign though. You're in the Tower right now. Uh, you're going through some powerful realization here where you are like 
like questioning everything, the marker, questioning who you are right now, what your label is in your own situation or your title, something like that. And uh, you are seeking answers here. Mm -hmm. And you will be playing a different role. You want something to end here, Leo. You do. So let's see why you are in the tower right now. The Four of Swords. You're thinking of ending your situation right now. Pretty sure here. Yeah, because these are uh, two different energies. One is a healing, one is an ending. Yeah, you're thinking of, of ending your situation or reflection. And a shocking... Uh, like the tower can be like a shocking surprise sometimes, but it's not here. You are think he in this uh, context. You are thinking of ending something. In the past, you were the wounded warrior. Like you already gone through a lot here in the past, but uh, you were dedicated to somebody here. You were, you, or you were putting in the work with somebody, and you were worried about what's going to happen next. Maybe because you're in another union, Leo. Your challenge is the Three of Pentacles and the Page of Wands reversed. You want a new path here, and, you know, there could be a third party here, and this is kind of like what is your your dilemma. And I feel like this is true in this reading. There's some type of third party. I mean, if you're not trying to leave your situation because you love somebody else, uh, you know, the third party could also be, on, in some, on some level or in some way, context that, Third party might be your mother-in-law or something like that, right? Or family members. Because we know that some people are in unions where family members are just, they're awful. And in, I don't necessarily maybe mean your own family. Sometimes, you know, in-laws are just, they get in your business. They think if you're married to their daughter, they can treat you awful. I mean, it could be, you know, it, it, it's a plethora of possibilities. And we have the Ten of Swords and the Page of Swords reversed. This is what you want. You want to figure out if you're going to end something with somebody. I feel like that's it. I also feel like you are no longer interested in somebody, so you want an ending. Yeah, you're in some type of a situation that does not bring you joy. Six of Cups. You want somebody from your past. I feel like you want to leave another situation. And the High Priestess card and the Empress is in your fear or your doubt. Two of Pentacles reversed. I don't know. You could be like, I mean, this is interesting here. Maybe you are doubting or fearing a Pisces or a Scorpio that you are that you are dealing with. This could be with the Empress, Libra, or or Taurus. But you're fearing here, maybe you drop somebody here. And you're afraid here that, you know. You could be afraid somebody knows here about what you're trying to do here with the high priestess she's the all-knowing you could be i feel like you're afraid somebody knows here yes the two of pentacles reversed that you have kind of like figured out your situation that's the person who's trying to stop you from having what you want that's the person who is you know driving a wedge or trying to drive a wedge between you and someone else they could be figuring out they could be trying to figure out what has caused this casualty yeah and the strain card is in the past for them with the Six of Swords. They were trying to have courage. I feel like it was about you leaving. Maybe about them leaving. The World card about a cycle ending. They have the Ten of Cups right now. They could be in despair. They could be sabotaging you. I feel like you're married to them for some of you guys. Ten of Cups possibly or in this union. You know, like a family type dynamic maybe. And then the, ten, the King of Wands. This is you, Leo. I feel like they're in despair here about you. They could be sabotaging you right now. They could be cutting you out. It's possible. Uh, but this fives, fives are, this is, they're at a turning point about you. They're in crisis about you. The Knight of Cups, they feel like you have a lot, uh, maybe they're a water sign, but I feel like they think you have, like you're in love with somebody else. Maybe your person is Pisces here. Or Cancer with the King of Cups and the King of Wands. Interesting. I feel like your person is like, They could have left you in the past. I feel like they were looking for their courage. And they are either in despair or they are sabotaging the situation. Maybe they are in sabotage mode because they are trying to drive, they are trying to stop you from having what you want. The challenge uh, for them is the King of Pentacles and the Fool. They think you want like another adventure, like you want to take a risk on somebody else. 
the seven of cups I think you're making a choice here and I feel like what you are fearing over here is if they know it's a possibility Leo OMG what they want is the ten, the eight of cups and the five of wands so here they are like I feel like they are just challenged here and they want you to leave walk away from somebody else and they are emotionally like not satisfied here and they have the chariot card. I feel like they want you to leave somebody else and they want victory or they want you guys to overcome the situation. And this is why they are trying to stop you or put drive a wedge between you and somebody else. The Queen of Wands, that is you. And in their fear is the uh, the Queen of Pentacles and the Five of Cups. They, they think this is going to end because of an earth sign. Maybe they're an earth sign, but I feel like they... They definitely uh, feel like they're fearing an ending and emotional loss. They are, and the hierophant, maybe to their marriage, or maybe they think you're gonna, you know, you're gonna commit to somebody right away. There is somebody from the past here, and this is what I mean about a third party. It's like you know, you want the ten of swords and they want the eight of cups. I mean, th these are like, this is kind of like, or hoping for endings, yeah. And we're gonna find out, Leo. I really want to see this reading. This is, uh, I feel like this is an exciting reading. I mean. Compelling, maybe not exciting, but definitely compelling. There's somebody here you really want to be with. Somebody here that you love, big time. They bring you joy. Uh, the love card is here with Sappho. She's got her wings, right? She's ready to, you know, do this uh, with you. Whoever this is, the dancer, this is a celebration. Mm -hmm. So we're going to end the reading there, here, and uh, not there, here, but here, there. Yeah, and we're going to look at the underlying energies, Leo, and how they feel about you, how they are seeing the situation, what's most important to them, right, or pressing, or consuming them, maybe, and what they hide, or you don't know about them, actions they're going to take, and their true intentions, and they're all super affordable, Leo, and thank you so much for joining me here, please remember to like, share, and subscribe, I really appreciate you guys, thanks so much, guys, for watching.